This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. And of course, we've discussed all of this in the archives, including almost five hours on Bret Hart in the WWF. But did you think that Bret returning was something that was necessary at that point in the battle against WCW? It was like a shot in the arm for the WWF programming to have Bret. I don't even know if it was so much about the battle itself as it was nice to have Brett back in the fold as a talent and uh, another talent to work with. In addition to that, it was an opportunity for Steve to really get Steve's personality developed and get Steve involved in something that people can kind of sink their teeth into. So it, it was both. It was, man, we're happy to have Brett back. Um, to the battle at that point in time, the battle was the battle. And we were just trying to focus on our business and do what we had to do. Let's, uh, let's also add some context to, you know, the, the whole Bret Hart contract. How do you think wrestling might've been different? It's always fun to look back and say, what if, what if Brett had not come back to Vince and signed a 20 year deal? What if he had taken the WCW money in 96, how different would wrestling have wound up? Do you think? Well, you know, I mean, that's, that's a crazy what if, because you look at just not the business aspect of it, but then you have to look at the creative aspect of it. What became of Brett returning and what became of all that strife and the whole Mr. McMahon character emerging from the Montreal screw job. Um, so the, you know, it's, it's hard to tell. It really is hard to tell. I, I think that Steve probably would have been pushed up, um, a little faster, a quicker, I don't, and I don't know that Steve would have had the had the the same effect that he had later had he not had Brett and the whole Canada versus USA uh, thing later on to work with. Well, and the double turn at WrestleMania thirteen. Right. I mean, it is interesting to look back and think, sort of, what if? Like, would Sean have been quote unquote injured and unavailable for WrestleMania thirteen? It's just, it's fascinating to look back and say, what if, but I think we could all agree. Timing is everything. Uh, the observer would write the original plan for Vader to beat Sid at buried alive, uh, and to beat Michaels for the title at survivor series Farouk and Vader were both told they had to switch the original plans and not give them the belts because JJ Dillon was at the meetings where those long-term plans were made. And since he now works for the opposition, they had to change all the storylines we knew. Buddy, that sounds like the biggest bunch of bullshit I've ever heard. Is that really the way things went down or, or what was told of these talents? Do you think, or is this just rumor and innuendo? That's just rumor and innuendo. I, I think that that's JJ trying to make himself sound important. Right. And when you JJ say JJ wasn't at those meetings, JJ wasn't involved in creative. You're saying like that. No, not at that time. Absolutely not. Let's, uh, Let's talk a little bit about a Fort Wayne, the Fort Wayne show. This is where Bret Hart comes back, but backstage, we have a pretty scary incident. Chief J Strongbow had what he thought at the time was a heart attack and he's found slumped over while sitting in a chair. Do you remember this little scary moment? I, I do. I just remember it from the standpoint of that's not right. And chief being taken away and, and people thinking, oh man, he must've had a heart attack. And at that time, I don't think it was a heart attack. I think it was just more of a, not even a panic attack, but chief wasn't doing well at the time. Chief was, was not that healthy. Hey, Hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell. So you get a notice anytime we upload some new content and go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30 year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.